Today is a day for celebration in San Diego. What's all the excitement about? Because on this day, 442 years ago, the Portuguese conquistador Juan Rodriguez Cabrillo landed on the shores that is now San Diego. He named it San Miguel and described its harbors as closed and very good. Let's pretend that today there are no high-rise buildings over there and the year is 1542. Juan Cabrillo and his crew are about to arrive on our shores. The Indians are cautious. Are these strange-looking white men friendly? The others flee, but three remain to give the Spaniards gifts. The explorers observe yet another new western port, and Cabrillo has sealed his place in history. He's the first European ever to set foot on the west coast of the future United States of America. Cabrillo's voyage wasn't heralded at the time because he set out to find the seven cities of gold and other mythical lands, those he didn't discover. But his discoveries certainly were important. He was the first European to come into San Diego Bay and then to travel on what is now the California coast all the way up to Oregon and then to report that back to the European countries. Once a person has discovered something, one of the elements to be credited with a discovery is to make it known to other people. And Carrillo did that, and so that's the reason he he's, uh, stands out among people who came here. Today, millions of people pay tribute to the great Western explorer by visiting the Cabrillo Monument. It was dedicated in 1949, the result of years of community efforts. The majestic statue keeps watch over one of his finest discoveries. You disappointed that you didn't find the cities of gold. Se já desapontado que não achou a cidade de ouro. De maneira nenhuma porque descobri a nação mais liberal e democrática do mundo. He is in no way disappointed because he uh, opened the doors for the most beautiful state in the whole world, California. For 21 years, San Diegans have saluted the explorer with the two-day Cabrillo Festival. Mexican, Spanish, and Portuguese dancers displayed their talents. Mayor Roger Hedgecock was on hand to open the festivities and honor its Grand Marshal, Mary Moniz. Hundreds of people turned out for the festivities. Here are two San Diegans who saw the event for the first time. We came down today to spend the day down at the beach, and then we saw all the festivities going on, and what a wonderful day. We thoroughly, thoroughly enjoyed it. Especially enjoyed the Navy band and their program they put on this afternoon. It was wonderful. I think it was, everything was good, but I was impressed with the Navy band very much. Cabrillo and his crew may not have found the seven cities of gold, but they did discover a land that we as modern San Diegans treasure. I'm Barbara Johnson. Join us again next week for another edition of Take 5 San Diego. Okay.